Every day when you wake up, you got two options. You can look at the clock and hit the snooze. You can look at that snooze button, boom. You can hit the snooze button and go back to bed. That's right, and do what? And dream. That's right, you can go back to sleep and dream about what you want to have. Right, right there with your comfortable pillow. You dreaming about what you want to be. Or you can look at that snooze button, kick that clock and get up and go pursue your dreams. If you're still on that procrastination stuff, let it go. Stop procrastinating. Stop talking about what you're going to do. Do me a huge favor. If you're still talking about your dreams, if you're still talking about your goals, but you have not done anything, just take the first step. The first step is stop talking about it. The second step is just take one step toward it. But I dare you, I double dare you, I triple dare you the next time you get up at 3.30 in the morning. I dare you not to go back to sleep. I dare you to get up and I dare you to chase your dreams. Remember, hey, I told you before, it ain't about your past. It ain't about your future. It's about your present. I dare you to understand that you got value. I dare you to start uh, uh, spending enough time where you get to explore who you are, to see who you are, so you can find out what you do that nobody else does, so you become valuable enough, amen, to be an asset. I dare you to invest in yourself. If you want to make more money, if you want to be more successful, if you want to have and do stuff you ain't never done before, well, I'm asking you to invest in you. If you really want to become you and you want to be an individual and you want to take your game to a place you've never taken it before, I need you to invest in your mind. And so I'm challenging y'all a book a week. I'm challenging y'all to go to conferences. I'm challenging you guys to invest in your mind. Listen to me, what you need to do to get to a place in your life that you blow up is one, to become the right person. Because when you become the right person, what you do is you show your worth, you show your value. You were created with a specific purpose, a specific design. I don't care if you was born and you know your parents didn't claim you, you still special. I don't care if your mama went in your life, your daddy went in your life, you are still special. When you were created, you were designed to do what nobody else can do. When you become the right person, when you become the right person, what you do is you start separating yourself from other people. You begin to have a certain uniqueness. What I mean by the right person is, once you identify who you are and you begin to separate yourself from the masses, and you begin to see your individuality, when you begin to see your talents, when you begin to see your personal skill, when you become who you are, when you become the person that you were created to be, designed to be who you were designed to be, when you become an individual, what you do is you, 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 you take yourself and you start separating yourself from other people as you become who you've been called to be, who you've designed to be, you're gonna become more and more and more valuable.